My name is Janie Bavici and I'm the director of the New York City Mayor's Office of Resiliency. I'm responsible for helping to prepare the city for the unprecedented challenge of climate change. We're uh, facing more extreme coastal weather events, coastal storm events, um, such as Hurricane Sandy, and we expect uh, those kinds of storms to continue to uh, become more frequent and more intense. Lower Manhattan is the economic hub of not only the city, but also the country. By 2100, we expect 50% of Lower Manhattan to be at risk to uh, coastal storms, storm surge from coastal storms, and also by 2100, we expect 20% of the streets of Lower Manhattan to be subject to daily tidal inundation. The city is implementing a $20 billion resiliency and adaptation strategy citywide. This work is focused on adapting uh, to the risks of sea level rise, storm surge, extreme heat, and intense precipitation. I'm standing here on a sand dune on Rockaway Beach. Uh, this dune, the city actually built this dune after Sandy to provide uh, protection for the Rockaway community. Um, it's just one of the layers of protection in our multi-layer strategy. We've also put more sand on the beach, so the beach is wider than it's ever been before. And we've rebuilt the Rockaway boardwalk. Um, it's now 5.5 uh, miles of steel reinforced concrete. Here in New York City, we expect temperatures to rise by 4.1 to 5.7 degrees Fahrenheit and the number of days above 90 degrees Fahrenheit to triple by the 2050s. The Cool Roofs program is focused on painting rooftops with a special white reflective coating that keeps buildings cooler but also reduces ambient temperatures in the neighborhood when we can uh, do them in, in clusters. We've painted 10 million square feet of rooftops white so far and we aim to paint at least one million square feet a year. The way I see uh, building resilience of the city is sort of like strengthening your immune system. We know that there will be uh, more extreme weather that the city has to deal with, just like you know that you're gonna get a cold, you can't stop it. But you wanna make sure that you're preparing your body to weather that cold and recover as quickly as possible. In the same way, we're preparing the city to bounce back from extreme weather events as quickly as possible.